When 3 Eye Atlas shot into our solar system, it was moving at a jaw-dropping pace, 61 kilometers per second. To put that into perspective, that's nearly twice as fast as most comets we've ever tracked. At first, scientists thought they had it figured out, just another icy traveler burning up as it swung past the sun. But then, something unexpected happened. Instead of acting like a normal comet, 3 Eye Atlas started changing and the mystery only deepened from there. Uh, from images, we also saw that this object is active, which means that around the nucleus there is some coma, which is an indication that this object is in fact a comet. Astronomers first spotted 3 Eye Atlas in early 2025, and right away it stood out. The reason? Speed. It was racing past the Sun at 61 kilometers per second, almost twice as fast as the comets we're used to tracking. That made it the fastest natural object ever recorded in our solar system. From the very beginning, one thing was clear. This wasn't a local visitor, it came from the stars. At first, 3 Eye Atlas looked like a comet. It had a shimmering tail and a faint misty glow, a coma of gas and dust wrapped around its core. Nothing unusual, at least on the surface. But then, things started to shift. The tail stretched far beyond what models predicted. The coma thickened, brightening in ways scientists couldn't explain. And then its light began to flicker, almost rhythmically, as if the object itself was alive. These weren't just small surprises, they were red flags. Something about 3 Eye Atlas didn't fit the rulebook, and as astronomers kept their telescopes locked on it, the mystery only grew deeper. Because what happened next proved this was no ordinary comet. When 3 Eye Atlas first appeared, it wasn't just another comet drifting by. It glowed an eerie red, light that seemed to come straight from its surface, not from the dust cloud around it. Strange, yes, but then it got stranger. Within weeks, that glow shifted. Red turned green. During a total lunar eclipse, astronomer Michael Joga and his team aimed their telescope into Namibia's dark skies. What they captured shocked everyone. The comet wasn't fading, it was transforming. By August 2025, the Very Large Telescope uncovered the reason. 3 Eye Atlas was suddenly spewing cyanide gas, toxic clouds that glow green under sunlight. That alone was unsettling. But buried in the data was something even more disturbing, nickel without iron. In nature, that pairing is almost non-existent. On Earth, it's usually the fingerprint of metallurgy, industry, or something deliberately engineered. That left scientists staring at a possibility they'd never expected to confront. What if 3 Eye Atlas wasn't entirely natural? And just when they thought the mystery couldn't deepen further, the comet unveiled a feature no one thought possible. Comets have tails that always point away from the sun. Always. It's one of the most basic rules of space science. But in September 2025, astronomers spotted something that broke that rule wide open. 3 Eye Atlas seemed to carry a second glow, one that pointed directly toward the sun. This so-called anti-tail, it wasn't a trick of the light, it was real. Scientists explained that as the comet's leading edge baked under solar heat, chunks of ice the size of buildings were breaking free. Unlike fine dust, these fragments were too heavy for the solar wind to sweep away. Instead, they lingered in the comet's path, scattering sunlight in a way that made the tail look like it stretched forward. The effect was mesmerizing, but also deeply unsettling. No interstellar object had ever shown such behavior. Even among local comets, anti-tails are rare and fleeting. Its sudden appearance around 3 Eye Atlas suggested that something about its structure or its journey was entirely different, and nothing that we already knew of. And that left scientists with more questions than answers. Was this a natural quirk of physics, or a sign of something even stranger hidden within the object's core? And yet, this wasn't the only shocker. Because scientists still can't agree on how big this object really is. At first, astronomers thought 3 Eye Atlas was big, maybe 3 to 10 kilometers wide. That alone would have made it a heavyweight compared to most comets. But then the numbers changed. The new math didn't just push the limits, it shattered them. 
The core could be anywhere from 20 to 46 kilometers across. If that's true, then 3i Atlas isn't just large, it's monstrous, potentially a million times more massive than Oumuamua or Borisov, the two interstellar objects we've seen before. And here's the catch, interstellar space shouldn't be able to build something this big, the raw materials just aren't there. So, what are we looking at? A super comet born in the violent outskirts of another star system? A chunk of some ancient shattered planet wandering the galaxy for billions of years? And this is the exact thought that makes scientists uneasy, something designed to look comet-like hiding a very different reality inside. Whatever the answer, the sheer scale of 3i Atlas forces us to confront a possibility no one expected. And as scientists argued about its size, another clue emerged, the timing, because the path of 3i Atlas isn't random at all. Most interstellar objects tear through the solar system at steep angles, slicing across the planetary plane like cosmic bullets. But not this one. 3i Atlas is moving almost perfectly aligned with the ecliptic plane, tilted less than 5 degrees, the odds of that happening by chance roughly 1 in 500. That uncanny alignment guides it past Venus, Jupiter, and most importantly, Mars. It feels less like a random trajectory and more like a carefully plotted course, the kind human engineers use when planning spacecraft flybys to squeeze the most out of planetary encounters. And then comes the strangest twist. When 3i Atlas makes its closest approach to the Sun in October 2025, Earth will be positioned on the exact opposite side, as far away as it can possibly be. Statistically improbable, narratively chilling, coincidence or design. And that leads us to Mars, the planet about to have a front row seat to the most mysterious object of our time. On October 3rd, 2025, 3i Atlas is expected to pass close to Mars. For astronomers, this is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. NASA's Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter will attempt to capture high-resolution images using its high-rise camera, though not sharp enough to show fine detail. These images could confirm whether the comet emits its own light or simply reflects it. Other missions, like NASA's Psyche spacecraft and ESA's JUICE probe, may also be able to gather data. If successful, this will mark the first time an interstellar object is observed from another planet. But here's the fear. What if 3i Atlas behaves in ways no one expects, as it interacts with Mars's gravity? Some scientists worry it could fragment, flare, or even alter its course in a way that challenges our current models. And that's where speculation turns into something even darker. What if it isn't natural at all? The nickel without iron signature, the anti-tail, the suspicious trajectory. On their own, each might be explained away with some clever piece of physics. But taken together, they paint a picture that's far harder to ignore. Some scientists can't help but compare it to Oumuamua, the first interstellar visitor once speculated to be a light sail or even an alien probe. If 3i Atlas were artificial, what would that mean? Could it be an ancient derelict craft drifting silently for billions of years, a fragment of long-lost technology outliving the civilization that made it? Or worse, could it still be active, following a deliberate path, weaving through planetary encounters for reasons beyond our understanding? Publicly, astronomers urge caution, but behind closed doors, many admit the same thing. 3i Atlas stretches the definition of normal further than any object before it. Still, whether natural or not, there's one more factor that makes this object unlike anything we've ever seen – its origin. When astronomers traced 3i Atlas backward, its trail pointed to the Sagittarius constellation, the same region of sky where strange radio signals have been picked up for decades, including the legendary 1977 WOW signal. Maybe that's coincidence, maybe not. Either way, nobody missed the connection. And here's the wild part. 3i Atlas could be older than the solar system itself. For billions of years, it's been drifting through the galaxy, weaving past exploding stars, crossing clouds of raw stardust, and soaking up exotic chemicals no local comet has ever carried. Every encounter left its mark, making it stranger, older, and harder to explain. So, 
This isn't just some random chunk of ice and rock paying us a visit. It feels more like a messenger from deep time, a frozen relic carrying whispers from an era before Earth even existed. And that brings us to the final unsettling truth, what happens next? Right now, 3 Eye Atlas looks like a comet, but every observation adds new twists. Strange chemistry, impossible tales, suspicious alignments, and the closer it gets to Mars, the higher the stakes. Will it simply pass by, fading into the void? Or will it reveal something extraordinary or terrifying? One thing is certain, scientists will be watching every flicker, every change, every fragment it shreds. Because objects like this, they don't just rewrite textbooks, they force us to question whether we're alone and whether the universe is far stranger than we ever dared to imagine. If you found this as fascinating as we did, make sure to like, subscribe, and share, because the story of 3i Atlas is still being written, and the next chapter could change everything.